Alright. Wanted to get the coins. More money. So we got the sprocket piece. Oh, he got snatched up by a pterodactyl. Oh, and it took it. It took it. it took it away. That is one huge bird. Actually, that is one huge reptile. But more importantly, it looks like we need to reach those higher depths now. Good news. No problem. I can do it. There's the sprocket, Bob. That mama pterodactyl must have broken free. But she's sticking around because all these babies are still captive. We should do something to help them. Don't worry, we will help them. But first, we have to get that sprocket back. You sound just like Sly. <laughs> be careful you don't wake her or those babies up. I don't think she'll be very happy to see you. Climb up, but don't wake the babies. So how do I stay quiet enough to climb? Don't wake those babies. You don't want to attract Mama Pterodactyl's attention. So maybe not hit the eggs? Go, go, go. So they'll wake up every now and then. Ow. Okay, he went back to sleep, go. Working our way up. So close. Yes, made it. On the first try, too. So finally, we got it. It's a good thing no pterodactyl who didn't show up and take it again because there was one flying around as I was climbing. So that was good. <clears throat> so Murray has another job, starving hippo. But let's check the thief net for available parts. Light as a feather. Allows Murray to sprint while carrying something by holding R1. Before I actually start, I'm actually going to save and split it because I'm actually going to try to go out and get more treasure because I know it's more treasure out in uh, the stage and try to see what I can find for more like coins and everything like that. So I'm actually loot with Sly and try to 
head out and get more coins. Even though he doesn't have a job available, I'm just gonna get more coins so I can get. Stay having a good amount of coins for uh, like upgrades later on.